Okay. Is that cute? Cut it, cut it, cut it, cut it, cut it. Do not wash your motherfucking body before you wash your hair. Hey, it's Natty, and welcome back to another one of my YouTube videos. If you're new, please go ahead and go to that Q&A that I posted. So you could get to know a little bit more about me. Um, I know you guys have been asking where have I been. I just had to take a little break. I wasn't really motivated to get up and like do a video. I like my life was like really really boring. It was no point to record nothing at all. But I am giving you what y'all wanted. This wasn't a highly requested video, but it was. But as you can tell by the title. We're going to be doing a hygiene routine. I'm going to be taking you step by step on what I do. And also remember that what works for me might not work for you. What I like, you might not like. Okay. Okay. So, y'all, <laughs> I miss talking to y'all like getting to it. I just want to start the video off by just saying you need to drink water okay you need to drink water you need to be taking like especially as a woman you need to be taking your vitamins you need to be taking you know your pills for daily feminine health or whatever this is not like a feminine hygiene and it's not specifically on that but I know a lot of people don't drink water a lot of people I know don't drink water they drink juice and pop y'all need to drink water that's why i'm trying to i'm trying to start this video off with saying drink some water because that's no and don't just drink water just to just to for your poom poom because no you just need you your body literally thrives off of water you need to be drinking water if you don't drink water you need help you can't make up no excuse that i don't think i think uh, it's flavored water out there it's some healthy flavor water out there. Drink you some water. For real. Stop playing. Okay, so the first thing I do is I start my oral care. So, I go into flossing, like, automatically. That's my first step of oral care. Y'all need to floss. It shows when you don't floss. Your gums will literally bleed. Like, you need to floss, okay? Please floss. You have food and stuff stuck in your teeth and you're wondering why your teeth did like why your breath still stink because you're not flossing i use floss picks or whatever um i know a lot of people who use water floss like a water flosser that is also good i also used that before but i i ain't like it for real for real just because i hate how i had to like plug it up like if that's the one I had, I had the one where you plug it up. I gotta get a battery one. Okay, so when I'm done flossing, I'm going ahead and I'm finna go brush my teeth. Now, let me tell you, let me tell you. This is a toothbrush I use. I really don't care if it's uh, an electric toothbrush. I really prefer a manual because I like to get it all myself. When I tell you you need to brush your fronts, go to the front, but on the side other side you need to be brushing your like teeth thoroughly you need to get in the inside on like the back of your teeth especially at the back right here uh, these teeth you need to get that you need to go up do the same stuff back of the teeth with the root you need to make sure you get like all of that especially if you got a wisdom tooth growing in you need to be brushing down there because you can get an infection you need to brush your roof you need to brush your gums brush your gums and brush your roof i know 
if you sit here just brushing the the you know the outside of your teeth where people see you smile at that's uh-uh uh-uh you need help you need some like serious help because and and i'm here to help you i'm here to help you okay you need to be like literally brushing your teeth thoroughly okay rinse your rinse look rinse your toothbrush off go in with some more toothpaste I already showed y'all toothpaste. I'm trying to, I'm, I said I'm trying to use. I already showed y'all what toothpaste I use. You need to go in with some more toothpaste. You need to get your tongue, okay? Scrub, like, literally scrub your tongue. That is where all the bacteria is. You need to scrub your tongue or your breath. Your, your breath is not going to last that long. It's actually going to, it's going to stink so bad. You... Mm -mm. Your friends, when you in their face, they gonna be like, like, <laughs> mm -mm, mm -mm. like you need. That's embarrassing. You need to get your tongue. Now, now look. Don't just brush your tongue and think they're too cool. You need a tongue scraper, okay? You need a tongue scraper. A metal one. A metal one for real for real because what you could do like what I do when I go to disinfect this on some days I literally put this in boiling hot water you can't do that with a plastic one it's gonna fuck up you need a metal one you can use a plastic one and just like keep going and like buying somewhere but I be using a metal one it came with two packs um so I got this one and I got another one it's like a, this one is a long one then it's like a short one that came in there but you need to like literally scrape your tongue rinse it off of water now what i do is i literally scrape my tongue rinse that off while my tooth on a clean toothbrush so mind mind you rinse your toothpaste off after you brush your tongue so the clean wet toothbrush i go on with my um toothbrush again and it's like a pattern you know like it's like a pattern then i go in with the scraper and i go back in trust me you might be like nat that's doing too much but it's not literally like this will have your breath smelling good all day. That and flossing, literally. And then I use um, mouthwash. I actually, TikTok actually told, showed me that my mouthwash was like top, top 10 risk of cancer, like mouth cancer or whatever. I, th I threw that motherfucker down the drain. So I'm still on a hunt for some like some good one i forgot i think it's like blue or red or green some some green some red i don't know what it is but i'm trying to find something with like a lower percentage of that because i like mouthwash but that took that took me out literally okay so next i'm gonna go ahead and go in with my skincare routine and when i tell you the products is gonna be so small but they last they last me for like six months literally like because you don't have to use a lot you literally a little like a little bit goes a long way literally so this is the cetaphil skin cleanser or whatever and it's for it's gentle skin because my skin is sensitive a little bit actually goes a long way please make sure before you even touch your face you wash your hands or you're gonna break out i'm telling you i did that mistake before like Nobody told me nothing about it. I had to self-teach myself shit. Please make sure you wash your hands before you go in and clean your face. Touch your face at all. Wash your hands. But I go ahead and I use this. I lather that all up in my face. Then I go ahead and I take a face cleansing brush. This one, I think I got this. I got this from Walmart as well. This is the Con Conair. I don't know. It worked good for real for real my last one worked better than this but this was um this was um a backup because my last one broke the last one i had i got that from five and below literally and it worked better than this but this still it still does justice this still does justice okay now it's actually time for me to step in a shower after i did my oral hygiene routine and my skincare routine now it's time to hop in the shower. Okay. 
and if I'm washing my hair, I wa I don't care what I wash my hair with, honestly, as long as it smells good and it get it get my hair clean. So this, I got this from Dollar General. I don't, I I believe that they do sell this at Walmart, but I'm not pretty sure. I got this from Dollar General. Budget friendly hygiene. I, man, don't don't try to even say nothing to me because I will punch you in your face. It still have my hair smell good. You coming to me and you. And I whip my hair in your face, and you're going to be like, oh, that's, bro, Matt, your hair smell good. Yeah. Fuck. This is the real five. Strawberries and cream. Now, look, let me tell you. Let me tell you guys. When y'all go to wash y'all hair, do not wash y'all body before you wash your hair. Why would you wash your body and then wash your hair and have all that shit rinsed down on your clean body? Do it make sense so now your body dirty again? It do it do it make sense to you? Cause it makes sense to me. I wash my hair as soon as I get in the shower. If I know I'm washing my hair in this shower, I'm washing it first thing first. Like literally, that's the first thing I do in my shower. Double cleanse your hair. Literally, like wash two times. First time is just getting like for real, for real, like all the dirt up and stuff, and it's really not gonna have no like lather. The second time, that's when you're actually getting in that bitch and you're cleaning. You're actually cleaning your hair. Your hair is really going to smell good if you wash it two times. Trust me. Trust me. I know. And then I go ahead and I go in with my conditioner. Now, I go ahead and I go in my conditioner. And I let that sit in like a bun or something. And then I go ahead and I go on to my body. Okay? Do not. I'm going to keep saying it. Do not wash your motherfucking body before you wash your hair i'm talking to you i know you do it that's nasty stop get some help okay so after i'm done washing my hair i go ahead and i start to do my body hair first thing first you let me tell you you got to double cleanse you just like you double cleanse your hair you got to double cleanse your body first thing first i go in with my dove sensitive skin bar soap it's in here i keep it in it's on low case i don't like putting soap on a on like the bathroom little things i mean the bathtub things or nothing like i like put my shit in its own little container um you need to go in with this i what i use every day as like a rag just like literally just for this is i go in with a totally any rag okay you can get this shit from walmart as well this actually like this it's literally like a good access for later like i picked this bitch up and i'm like damn i never heard of this shit let me give it a try when i tell you i use this like every day it's not too rough it's not too gentle it's like literally just something perfect you can use every day like daily it won't break your skin barrier or nothing like this shit and they have your skin soft as fuck like literally go ahead and i go with this my bar soap I get all over my body okay so a lot of people ask like um what do you do if you want to exfoliate down there me i use the rag you can use the rag down there but i use the rag just on my body and not down there i go ahead and i go in with an exfoliating glove mine is in a washer but i go ahead and i go in with an exfoliating glove to exfoliate down there because you know you don't want no sugar scrubs down there sugar scrubs going on there if you do that and it works for you then fine that's you i don't prefer it at all i i, I don't even want to attempt it or nothing i don't prefer it that's one thing i can't say so after i go on my bar so i go straight to shaving before i go in with my body wash so when i shave i'm not going to bring out my razor but i use the venus razor and when I shave, I have to be, like, in a mood for, like, a scrub or whatever. Like, like the scent of the scrub. Normally, like, my go-to, as you can see, let me close it. Because like, it, like, won't close. I know y'all probably like that. What the fuck? This is, bro, there's still some in there. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. I'm using that bitch till it's clear as fuck. Until a straight bottle, literally. This is my go-to. This right here literally gets me right every time it literally gets me right every time okay this this is good 
as well i'm just gonna tell you this now this is like more of a messy one just because it got water like i don't know if it's like real watermelon seeds but i seen all over tiktok that these is real watermelon seeds they feel like it but i don't think it is it might be though but they got like seeds to like represent a watermelon and that should get all of real bath yeah like all of real bathtub okay this is just like any regular scrub this it's like a messy one they both smell good they both is real good at fucking exfoliating this though as you can see is my like my go-to literally after i exfoliate i go straight in with shaving i don't have i don't use no shave cream or whatever i just use um this dove is it's the dove deep moisture but it's the foam one i'm gonna show a picture because i don't feel like going to get that i forgot that but that's what i use and it turn like when you put it on your skin it get like real real like creamy so like that's what i use to shave but when i'm shaving my pum pum with a different razor don't shave please god don't shave with the same razor with your pum pum as you shave with your legs you know it's it's unhygienic but when i go in with my pum pum when i go to shave my pum pum i use the dove sensitive skincare hyperallergic wash and it's for like babies this hasn't done me wrong i'll use this to wash my kitty wit and everything it has not done me wrong hasn't irritated my skin hasn't threw nothing off when i tell you this bitch this bitch go hard literally like oh my gosh this is like chef's kiss this is what i use to fully it down there just because i do not like putting no scented soap on my kitty especially like shaving and stuff like i'm super careful when it go to shaving this gets me right every time so after i'm done shaving everything i go ahead and i rinse all that shit off make sure my body is thoroughly rinsed off i go straight ahead and with my dove deep moisture when I tell you, this right here is God, like God's work. I don't, it smell like heaven, like literally, like I use this, ugh, I use this every day. And when I tell you, it leave your skin so moisturized, it does scent last like all day. And if you like me and you one of them girls who like, okay, they get out the shower and then like 30 minutes later after they getting dressed after they didn't did all that 30 minutes later they go in to the bathroom and it still smell like what you it's like what you just washed up with if you like that if you that type of girl or boy like this is like you your boy can use this too but if you that type of person when i tell you oh my gosh this this soap will last like literally for like hours in your shower literally door door wide open and everything this will last this please please take a screenshot please go get it like why tell you run don't walk this right here it smells so good it get like it gets you much right i can't rave about this soap enough i use this every day now if i'm in the mood to like switch some stuff up then i go ahead and i go with my dove mango I don't use this every day this is literally a like like a mood you know like and i and you like when you use this you have to like get like mango scented stuff to make the scent last longer like it's not one of dove's best best soaps that's one thing i would say but it smells really good it's um mango and almond butter but the scent does not really last that long unless you like get a dove not like a dove mango body polish if they even make it um tree hut mango scrub you need like to get like you need to have mango body lotion mango like you like you need to have the whole mango package to deal with this okay i'll go ahead and i'll go in with my body polish now i have three these are like my main choices for for lace deco these is like my main choices on like what i these is like these are my go-to basically like i would get all three of these when i'm going hygiene shopping all three i won't skip one and y'all see like 
all of them is like really like used but not really used like these bitches oh my gosh these bitches smack oh my gosh like when i tell you so the first one the brown one is the brown sugar and coconut butter this goes well with um i forgot what the dove body wash is called but i also love that one i love that one too the cocoa butter one i don't know i'm gonna I'm a insert a picture this crushed macadamia crushed macadamia and rice milk this go good with this literally like this shit low good together you might not think so but this shit do and this shit smell so good like oh my gosh yes bitch this then my last one is the pomegranate seeds and shea butter. Oh my gosh. Don't, bro, don't play with me. Don't play with me. Bro, this. You use these, right? And then you walk, you rinse them off. You use them. I use them right after I use my body wash and I shave and stuff. This right here will literally have your skin smelling good, like bro oh my gosh like you you just try it i'm telling you just try it okay so when i'm completely done with washing my body i go ahead and i go in with rinse my conditioner out and then i get out the shower get in my little slippers or whatever my little crocs is to walk to my room literally and when I tell you, especially after I exfoliate, I go straight in with the Vaseline Cocoa Radiant Body Oil. This bitch, oh my gosh. This will have your skin feeling so smooth. It will have your skin smelling good and also glowing. Like, this, the scent ain't really like, like it's a scent, but it's not really like a scent that would throw off like any of your body washes that you just use or like any of your perfume, any of your thing, like, you, this bitch right here, oh my gosh, this smack. I also use this. Now, a lot of y'all might think this is weird, but me personally, I like using oil, especially after I shave my pum pum. I like using oil down there. Only the top part. Only the top part. Please, only the top part. Literally, like, only the top part. This mug right here will have your kitty so smooth and glowy and... Yes, like, if you know what that is you know what that is because this oh my gosh it will have your skin like literally like ready to get a and like it will have your boyfriend or your girlfriend sitting here ready to tear you up not even know no sexual shit but like get this for real get this and i also use the jergens cherry almond this right here smells so good i um first used it at my friend's house when I did, I forgot to bring my body lotion. And I used this bitch and I went to go smell my skin. I'm like, oh, okay. Like, what? But I know a lot of people don't like this scent. You literally, when you go into the store, you literally have to like open a thing. Because it's like a scent that people love and also a scent that people hate. So it just has to be for you. But this bitch, it lasts like for like four hours. But when you pair it with this, you might be like, that's a weird that's a weird um combination but i'm telling you like i said this don't knock any scent off like it don't it don't make your your body smell weird or nothing when you pair with this this bitch lasts longer now i know a lot of people don't like the way oil feels on their skin um i go in with the baby lotion if i'm not using oil if i was you i would go in baby lotion or something else i don't really know anything for real, for real that will moisturize your skin just like how oil would this wouldn't moisturize like how oil would but it'll it'll definitely moisturize your skin and give you a good eye smell but this plus this oh my gosh run it go like but when i tell you this shit is so fucking good literally together like oh my gosh this shit is so fucking good and like what? You'll be going to sleep. Like as soon as you put your arm up, go to sleep. You smelling it, like, bro. This stuff is like really, 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 really good. 
Okay, so that's all for this hygiene video. It wasn't too many products I was missing in this video, for real, for real, like that I didn't have physically on me. But I will be showing pictures of every single thing in here so you can know the prices of them and shit like that. And the ones that I missed out on, you'll know what they look like, you'll know what to look for. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Comment anything that you like anything that you want to try in this video that you haven't tried or anything that you love that you already tried and you really really love um make sure you subscribe and push push that little bell notification thing please if you haven't already go watch my q a that i posted last time and i promise y'all i will be posting more for real all right but bye y'all i love y'all